Welcome everyone to this Node tutorial where we will explore a fascinating flow that creates a dynamic table format on the dashboard. Let's dive in. Here we have a Node flow with multiple nodes. Let's break down it down step by step. The flow starts with a group node called table format. It serves as a container for UI elements including the table. This group node houses for other nodes. The first node inside the group is a UI table node. It's responsible for creating a dynamic table you can see on the dashboard. The table has several columns with different data types and formatting to display the data attractively. For example, we have an image column that shows thumbnail images, clickable link and a progress column that represents the progress using a bar. The traffic column displays random traffic data while the color column shows a colored box. We also have a tick column to display tick or cross, back, cross marks based on the condition and a star column. A star rating. The row number column displays the row number at numbers automatically. Now let's focus on the inject node. This node triggers the flow by generating a payload containing the random data. The inject node is set to repeat every two units of time. In this case, two seconds, it sends a timestamp as the payload to the next node function. The function node is, is where the magic happens. It generates random data for the table function node creates an array of objects, each containing data for a row in the table. It generates random image URL, progress values, traffic data, colors, ticks and star rating. We have two rows of data here, but in the real world scenario, you could generate as many rows as you need. The generated data is then sent to the UI table node to update the table on the dashboard. Lastly, we have the UI template node. This node injects custom CSS to style the table. The CSS ensures that the images in the table cells have a fixed height maintaining a consistency look. And there you have it. This node red flow creates a dynamic table format with random data on the dashboard. You can use the flow to display any data you want like sensor reading, statistics or any other information you visualize. Thank you for joining me in this tutorial. I hope you found it helpful. Have fun exploring Node-RED and building amazing flows like this on.